Alright, g'day fellas, Austin Khan here, welcome back to more of Assassin's Creed Syndicate Part 9. This is survival of the fittest, Jacob and Pearl have nearly destroyed Milner's business, there's just one last thing to do. So we're going to do two more missions for the video, last episode went for about two, 28 minutes, uh, but I'll do this mission and of course the next mission we'll do after, and that'll be it for Saturday, then I've got Sunday videos. So the videos will be uploaded, one tonight, one tomorrow, and the other on Monday. Jacob Darling, do join me. To our fruitful partnership. And to the shiny new engines now in my possession. Back to business. Milner's fled to the Thames, occupied with securing his ferry. It's all he has left. Hmm, protected it with his life, no doubt. The very thing I want you to take. <laughs> Just kill him. That's not your first glass of champagne, is it? Success is more intoxicating than alcohol, Mr. Fry. Then save a glass for me. All right, do not touch River Thames. I always call it Thames, but it's Thames. Now, what uh, would it take to draw out Starrick's paw? The sight of his fairies in flames, perhaps. So we've got to be very, very careful, fellas. Does he know people would see him? Got a little book. That's cool. Ah, oh, crap. We've got to be very careful. Now the ferry mission that we did, that we're doing now, it reminds me of uh, Mafia. Alright, we can't go up that way. Damn, we've waited for a ship to arrive. Here we go. Hi, oh, that's an enemy. Stuff it, we're going. Go, go, Jacob, go! Alright, cool. Alright, that's is where we need to go. Jump! Jump! Swim! I don't know. Oh, come on! This sucks. Oh, hang on. I wanted to go that way, I was gonna say. Unless we have to restart it. Do, can we restart? Or can we. Yeah, we restart it. Okay. Red load, last checkpoint. Because we already watched the little uh, cinematic, so we'll have to uh, see. I think we're about to just start the mission. So I do apologize for that. So we'll do this mission, and of course. Uh, breaking news, and that'll be it for Saturday. Then we've got tomorrow's videos for Sunday, and uh, the videos should cover the week. But we'll see what happens, see how I feel in the afternoon because I'll be working uh, nine hours Monday, and then eight hours Tuesday, five hours Wednesday, eight hours Thursday, and then seven hours on Friday. And uh, I don't really have any uh, plans to be honest with you, and of course. This year is my fourth year working at my workplace. All right, so yeah, we just. Now, what would it take to draw out Starrick's paw? The sight of his fairies in flames, perhaps. We just restarted the mission, so I'll quickly head to this guy because I want to get some more stuff. I believe that should help you greatly. And we cannot touch the river at all, so we'll have to go that way. Focus on where we're going. Another ship coming. So let's go across. Nice. I 
we have some very, very amazing games coming out this year for 2023. Uh, there's about two or three that I want to buy at the moment, but for now, we'll see how we go for now. For this year. to sink Milner's Enterprise. Holy crap. Oh, there we are. Alright, use the smuggler's dynamite. Fusion dynamite crates. Ah, got ya. So, put the crate there. I just need to be. I need to be very, very careful. So, I want to do this as stealthily as I can. So what if... There we go. But, it won't let me move. I was about to say... Alright, um... Apologies for that. For some reason, I couldn't move my, couldn't move the character. I like the mission, the, uh, the mission so far. It's pretty cool. All right, let's do it, and boom. Crap, that's a lot of enemies. Alright, got one there, it's just chilling. Oh. 
was trying to aim for the head, but I guess that didn't work. Alright. Keep moving, fellas. Chilling on the ledge. Ah, not that way. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. All right, as those guys run the move. What's he doing? Uh oh. Like a boss. Okay, how are we doing now? Oh, what? Got more? Resources. <laughs> oh, thank God. I thought I was going to die. Should be okay. Now let's go up here. Alright, we're nearly to him. Heads up! We have an intrusion! Nice. I knew this day would come. Mr. Starrett was furious, I lost the engines. So this is my comeuppance. Pearl Attaway led me to you, not Starrick. Then they were gonna gather again. I should never have come between Mr. Starrick and Miss Attaway. Family always stay together in the end. What do you mean, their family? Alright fellas, we all know that what that means. It's time for us to uh get out of here. I think I've got I think I've got a smoke grenade. Time for Pearl and I to have a real conversation. Perfect. Alright, now we get out of here. Locate Pearl Attaway. Damn it, got away. Oh, no, there it is. Cool, now we can get away. there. I've, I've just got this uh, little ship to go to. Nice. Big jump, which we did pretty well. Ah, I've got a little shop over here. Alright, let's go. Nice. Now we can have a chat to him while we get some stuff. Cool. Come back again, by oh, I've got treasure maps as well. That's cool. Alright, my guess. I did fight target. Okay, we 
where is she? There she is. Rach Pell Attaway. I was certain he knew that I belonged to the Order and was there to end me. Imagine my delight when he told me his true purpose. An assassin helping the Templar calls. Isn't that deli- Hey, and we have to kill her? You too much, cousin. You will get your engines back. Our new motorized buses will bring us both a lot of money. I'll need to arrange proper transport for the engines to get back to my factory. I want you at Waterloo personally to ensure that nothing goes wrong. Of course. May the Father of Understanding guide us. Today and in all of our future endeavors, cousin. Waterloo Station. Door Dude. Door. Again? Just give it a shove. Damn! Uh -huh. She betrayed us. Well, no, she didn't really betray, but you know, she's. You no, know, she's a Templar, and we're assassins, so it makes perfect sense. Alright, now we need to get away. Get the hell out of here. Heck, I should say. Heck, not hell. Wow, this is a massive area. Nearly there. And... Nailed it. Nice. Alright, we've got another mission to do called Breaking News. Here we go, fast travel. Yes. So we'll do another mission for the day at the moment. What's today? Today's Saturday. It's almost five o'clock, so this will be my last video for the day, but I'll be back tomorrow for Sunday. We'll see what happens, I guess. Depends if we're really doing anything. So yeah, there was a game that I want to try out called Planet Side 2. It's free. It's only on PlayStation, PlayStation and Windows, Microsoft Windows. So we'll see what happens. I was I did a poll on Instagram and one person voted for no, 100% uh, for no. So it's likely that I won't play it. Fellas coming through. <laughs> Stealth kill at Mist Kill. That's the last mistake you'll ever make. I think I failed that. Yeah, I did. At least we've got some kills. That's good. Breaking news, Evie and Jake can visit Bell in his laboratory to continue their fight against Starek and his control of the press. Ah! Oh, 
Jacob, Evie, it's you. Thank goodness. Experimenting, are we, Alec? Correct. And looking a bit frazzled. Nerves. It's those great oafs Static keeps sending round to coax me. He is offering a ridiculous amount of money. Alec, you're not thinking of jumping ship, are you? Never. I've been working in something in case they get too insistent. Uh, it's meant to stun an assailant, should they need a rise. Are you certain that it works? Uh, not as such. I I've made three of them with varying degrees of acidity and whatnot. But one must be the right formula. Let's find some Staric lackeys to target then, shall we? <laughs> Speaking of Staric, he is still transmitting false information. We could simply destroy his transmitters. Well, his company's too well guarded. And the bombs will help, but it would be awkward to produce bombs that potentially do not stun. Oh, wait a minute. Looks like opportunity has come knocking. Oh, dear. They never looked so angry before. Stand clear, Alec. Let us instead play a little linguistic game with them. Um, take the bombs and climb onto the roof. Uh, when I see the name of uh, a fruit, Toss one near the thugs. Right then. Oh, uh, oh wait, uh, I nearly forgot. Um, slip these into your boots and you will henceforth be immune to all voltaic discharge. I think. This guy's a mad scientist. I mean, he's like an inventor. All right, so it reached the rooftop. <laughs> oh, I got some treasure. Oh, no, 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 Jacob, no, we need to go. Oh, that's how we do it, okay. All right, cool, so. Let's go here. Good day, gentlemen. Oh, I, I would ask you in for tea, because I'm afraid I'm running rather late. Enough of the nice teas. We've come to smash your place up, in we mess. You got one of them telly what's it's in here, ain't ya? You? You've been reading messages from the Steric Company. That is as untrue as the notion that the Steric Telegraph Company is emitting impartial information, sir. Come again? Your employer's promises are nothing but hot air, and his operations are about to turn pear shaped. What you going on about air and pears, Bob? Oh, I don't know, feel rough. Agility of a dollop of donkey's apples. It's kind of a funny game to be honest with you. Not game, but you know, mission I should say. Alright, I'll All right. open this one. Tell us where you keep that telly I'll count to three. Three? Well, well, let's see how far you get. One. Do you really think I would keep it here? Do you see a cable? A telegraph without a cable is about as useful as a bell without a clapper. I'll give you a bleeding clapper. Well, bless my boots, you're as purple as a plum. Serves you. 
Bravo, Alec. Thanks to you, Jacob. Your mere presence gave me courage and resolve I never knew I had. <laughs> I found myself rather witty, too. Well, make some more bombs and let's sort out Starek's propaganda machine, shall we? So I'm guessing these must be like a, a gas bomb, I guess. Come on, we haven't got all day. Follow Bell. The longer we can keep Staric from spewing out false information, the more we can awaken the people with the truth about his operations. Let's get to it then. Would you believe my mother says there are still some wives in her street that swear by that soothing syrup? So I took it upon myself to tell her neighbors the truth about the obnoxious draft. Good on you, Alan. But you can't go knocking on everyone's door. No, I wasn't always broken. But shows how false information can be as difficult to stamp out as fish wife's profanities at Billings Gate. <laughs> Or rats in the sewers. But if we can eradicate a source that continually feeds such detrimental trash, then little by little the truth will take the upper hand and the sham will be flushed out. Let's crack on. Here we are. We will have to get in without being detected, mate. While I stun them, you sneak inside. I shall destroy not one, but three parts of the transmitter. He'll be as good as dancing before a public toilet without a penny. Alright, electrocute thugs with vault or take bombs. Well, we've got one more left. So we'll see what happens next. Sorry. Where's Bill? Oh, there you are. Beautiful machine. Pet it's been soiled by corrupt means. Oh well. Oh, but the guards don't come patrol. I don't have any more bombs. Damn it, how do I get more bombs? It's gonna be as difficult as I thought. I see. This Crap. Is rather perilous, uh... to say the least. <laughs> 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 I've had that one, but I've pulled it as well as a dentist pulls a rotten tooth. Here. Move on to the next part, Alec. I just gotta be very, very, very careful. Deals, Jacob Evie. Thanks are once again in order for supporting what is most dear to me and to our cause freedom of speech. It's a blessing that you employ your genius for the common good, Alec. However, I suggest you vacate your workshop. No need. 
Not now you've given me sacks full of courage. And besides, what with my little devices, I have all the protection I need. Uh, should you find yourselves with a moment to spare, do drop by. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Alright, cool. Nice. Got a lot of XP, a lot of money, which means, fellas, we have to end it here. So, thank you for watching part 9 of Assassin's Creed Syndicate. I'll be back a bit later. Um, I'll be back next weekend with another episode for all of you. With three more videos tomorrow. But at the moment, I just want to check out any skills that we've got. We've got three we can get. Massive damage. Alright, let's do that one. We've got one more. Damn it, we can't. Can't do that. Gang up, great. Oh, we've got gear. Alright. Craft, that's level 4, but we need level 5. Level 4. Level 5. Not that one. Let's go with the belt. Craft and equip. Nice. Uh, what else? Upgrades. I just want to quickly check how we're doing. Craft. Yes. Nice. Got a lot of stuff. Got money as well, so that's cool. Gang upgrades. See how we're doing. Rook quarters. Rook. Look for them in the streets. Rook watches. More often than an archetype. Yeah, use that one. Okay, what else we got? I think that's it. Hang on. Insider. Children are the best thieves when you, you enter it. They'll give you better loot items. Just do that one. Favourite street. Oh yeah, do that one. What else? What else? What else? What's that one? Ale heist. Containing ale shipments run throughout the city. Hijack or escort them for a cash reward. Nice, well that fellas, we'll have to leave it to that. I think we have a bit more. Oh we don't. Alright, leave it to that then. Inventory, belts, how we doing so far? Level six, level five. Gonna need more money as well. Alright fellas, well thank you for watching part nine. I'll be back tomorrow with more missions. Uh, more videos for all of you to enjoy. Until then, see you next episode. Peace out mate.